great shot is we're missing a team, and that is uh, a 10 minute half time break. It's been extended to the full by the Chinese national team. They lead by five points, but they've not quite come out of the locker room yet. The Jordanian team is already out there awaiting them. out in a minute here they come trooping onto the floor now walking out quite sure the uh, stand about the game's about to start so they're not even getting a chance to run around a little bit at half time they've gone into the locker room sat down it could be an important uh, start to this uh, second half of China I'm not sure they'll be completely loosened up they send out the veteran He's out to probably the same stars as I would imagine for China that started the game. For Jordan, well, not quite because uh, our Farage is out there, I see. Also for Jordan, on the jar. Al Sous, Abrab, Zagab, and Jimmy B. Jimmy Baxter. There's the reversal here. Trail by five, Jordan. So China have to do some work here to make sure they can put this team away. Liu fumbles the dribble back to Wong Shipong, who's yet to score and does now. Talked before about only four scorers for China on the board. Well, now they've got a fifth in Wong Shipong. It's a long two. And a seven point lead. That's not bad. You come out of the locker room and nail a jump shot straight away. You can tell he's a shooter. Baxter turns the corner. Baxter goes up as a foul. Didn't quite get it to go down. So it won't be an out one. Foul goes with 15. Uh, First foul for the team from China. First foul for the second half China after 36 seconds. And Jimmy Baxter's on the line. Quite night for Baxter so far, or quite afternoon for Baxter. Three assists. Four points. He misses his first free throw. And the second one goes down. So Baxter, first score for Jordan, second half. Six points they trail by. Pong into Wang Zhuzhu, loves that backdoor cut that he was trying to make there. They covered it well there. He comes to the high post. Wang Pong, same place, offensive foul will go against Yi here. The problem was he's just holding down Hadrab as he went to get an offensive rebound and crash into the boards. He's still arguing with the referee. He's not uh, entirely convinced it was a foul for him. Seuss back to Baxter. Baxter playing more and more point guard since this, as this tournament goes on. And Jimmy B into a drab set was long two. Goes short. Zagab keeps it alive and does enough to make sure the ball is deflected. Last off the Chinese Leo Xiaoyu. And the ball stays with Jordan. You know what? China are going to huff and puff their way through this game, win or lose. Not going to be easy for him. Baxter penetrates. One stop, one pop. Baxter, the bottom of the net. Jimmy B. Gives the game a little more spice. He brings uh, Jordan within five now. Excuse me, got it wrong. Four, can't do my maths. Juju, easy cut. He does very, very well. Flush it with ease under the basket. Chinese begin to find holes underneath the bottom of that zone. Al Najar in the corner here. Missed a couple of J's already, Al Najar. All the way back to Al Suz. Jump shot, Al Suz. But Sam Al Suz drops two. And Jordan hanging around here. They're not going to be intimidated in this game. Ayu. Skip past the Zhou Pong. Wang Zhuzhu penetrates one dribble, fades, and that is what experience does for you. It makes things all look very easy. And pressure followed that down the floor. Oh, our still spins on Zhou Pong. Seuss penetrates right past Zhou Pong. Zagab. Al Najar. Al Seuss three. In and out. What a follow. Hadram. No bucks out of the back of that zone for China. At all. He 
And you see the follow there from Hadrab. Great slow motion action. And the lead is back to four for China. Wong Shipong here. Corner, Wong Zhuzhu. Jump shot good. Beginning to feel it in there. The veteran Chinese player. I wonder when the first time he put on sneakers for the Chinese national team was a few years ago now. Corner Al Seuss has to get out of there quickly. Those dribbles it out to the foul line, replaced by Abrab misses the shot. And the rebound from Xupong. Xupong <laughs> not quite expecting that pass, but uh, gets it eventually anyway. In the corner, Wong Juju goes up, and Zagab has been given an and one against him. It's the foul. Third foul for Zagab. He's just gone out to eight. Good play there. Generous continuation given by the referee. Hussein comes into the game now. Good shot here for. Go. The lead is now nine. Escaping slightly from the, the uh, Jordanians here. Well, Jar sits down. And his replacement is Al Maharai Shea. Got the ball here, seven for Jordan. Seuss. Three, Hadrab looked at it too. Too much faking going on. El Suz leads back to six. And as hard as China try, they cannot quite turn the screw, get it to double figure lead. Again, zone for Jordan now. They've got to try and stop these holes. Opening up. Wang Juju goes up. Will they count that one? I think they will. The veteran is going to work. Wang Juju with the two. Hussein, or is it Al Mahashe? I'm not sure. Second foul, second foul, number seven for Jordan Al Mahashe. Great move there for Wong Juju. Takes his two. That's the free throw with accuracy. The lead is nine again. The big fella from China. He's the leading scorer, 19 points out of China's 46. Only uh, Yi, the other player, in double figures. So for all the up-and-coming talent, it's the veteran that's getting the job done. Kept alive by Hussein, but can only tap it out of bounds. The zone for China is doing its job. Now, chance for China to get back even further. I think Jordan are going to come out and play man to man. It's their only option, really. Yes, indeed. Too many holes in the back of that zone as far as uh, Alexandris is concerned. Yi comes over to pick and roll. Hadrab shows. Yi now one on one. And what have we got here? It's a technical error here with the clock. Shot clock, I think they're in concern with. Came down to 14 now. 527, halfway through this third quarter. Shot clock for 14 seconds. Shot clock for 14 seconds. Shot clock turns the corner. Wong Shipong goes an extra dribble. Yi is wide open. Yi penetrates. Yi. Nice and easy. No help coming there. Timeout for Jordan. Gellis Alexandris is uh, irate as the Jordanian defense just opened up. Nobody else just uh, spectated. Just in awe of Yi's explosive uh, prowess.
πέσω άνα αυτό που σε προσβάλλεται από αυτό που είπα. Εγώ τι να κάνω με το πώ όπω παίζει αυτό και αυτό. Τι να κάνω. Παίζει. Είμαι, είμαι μαζί του τρει μήνε. Γιατί με προσβάλλει. Θέλω να το δείξω. Πόσε φορέ είπα. Don't give the baseline. How many? Θέλω να κερδίσει ή όχι. World Cup 2014 heading your way next summer. So right now, we're deep in the midst of a 5 to 8 battle here between China and Jordan. One of these two teams will be playing for honors uh, tomorrow night. Foul there on the baseline of that uh, Chinese 2-3 zone. It's either Yi or Wong Zhuzhu. I'm guessing it's Yi that had his hand up. No, it's gone against Wong Zhuzhu. Uh, it's his third foul of the game. 19 points, 3 fouls and 5 rebounds. Marcus will sit him down. Time here for Jordan because they might be able to get back into it. Al Suz is short on the three, and uh, not much going back. If Zhou Wong Shipong had looked up, he would have had uh, numbers going forward. Wong Shipong over to pick and roll, goes deep. Yi uh, Wong. Wong Shipong, the shooter misses the shot, and rebounded by Jordan, and they're off to the races here. A drab is ahead. Grab for three, brings forward Wang Zhuzhu, and decides Al Suz might be the best option. Hussein low post, guarded by the veteran. Hussein for two, and the lead is now nine. There is life in this Jordanian team. Do not write them off yet. Wang Shipong, pick and roll from Wang Zhuzhu. Yi, Wang Zhuzhu, layup, nice and easy. That's the way to play it. for China, Wang Zhuzhu will be leaving the game any minute now. Foul against uh, Liu Zhu. Comes out, Wang comes in. There's the sun coming in as well. Liu sits down. Xiao Yu, five for China, Sun Yue comes in. Seuss to Baxter. Baxter looking a bit disheveled with his shirt hanging out right there. Now Seuss, Baxter on the reversal. Now Seuss, another reversal here for Jordan. Well played. Three from Al Marche. That is terrific basketball from Jordan. Terrific with a capital T. Eight point game. Wong Shipong. Side screen there for China. He comes up to set the pick and roll. Wong Shipong comes over. Oh, Zhou Pong lost his concentration. The ball went right through his hands. And, uh, maybe a little moment here for Jordan to uh, creep their way back into this one. Marche picked up the dribble. Now Suze tails him out. Usei layup good. Six point game. Well, the substitution of taking Wang Zhuzhu at the game has proved crucial. As Jordan are right back in it. Sun Yue dances into the lane. Block shot, but foul against Hussein. That could be foul number four for him. Replay, make your own mind up. It is a foul, I think. There's elbow to elbow contact. Shots for the youngster. Shots here for Wang Julin. Just the first one to go down. Wang Julin, who's uh, seven points tonight. First time on the free throw line for the youngster. Second free throw is good.
next him. He's no pressure down the floor. He's got it by Yi. He might want to take Yi one on one here. He sinks into his stance defensively. Oh, Baxter fancies this one. Baxter kicks. Hadrab corner. Hadrab goes up hard and uh, draws the foul. This may go against Yi. No, it's against 15. Wong Julin. Uh, Zhong Po. Zhou Pong, excuse me. Second foul for Zhou Pong. Grab will get the shots here. Eight points the game. And creeps one in to make it a seven point affair. Hussein trying a bit of fancy dancing on that baseline, but well boxed out by China. And Sun Yue charges down to pick it up. Marche paying special attention to Sun Yue. Moving screen there. Wow, who's got that foul? Al Marche, I think. Oh, indeed. Oh, Al Marche, he looked like he rubbed off on the screen from Wong Julin. He didn't do too much, but uh, enough to draw the referee's attention. Here's the, the lob down to Wong Shipong. Sun Yue. Yi, he meets a wall that is. Uh, Hussein, I think Hussein's picked up foul. Muhammad uh, Hussein. Four. Four. shots here for Yi. Chinese uh, superstar. Zhifeng Yu will replace Xiu Number eight, for Yi with two shots here. And that with the first. Good shot here for Yi. And drops it down. Bit of pressure down the floor here for China. Alsus. is such a useful player for uh, Jordan the 14 very very uh, multi-dimensional now Seuss kick and roll from Hussein and Hussein is wide open he just couldn't see him Hussein back in in the post well played Jordan a drive backboard almost got it to go two minutes to go in the third quarter here China by eight but by far no way they're looking assured Yi low post there's a double down. Good play from Hal Marche. Sun Yue goes up and blows the layup. Al Seuss comes out of the pack. Al Marche drives hard to the hoop. Layup good. And a foul. You know, one of the weakest elements that I find in Chinese, this Chinese team, is their inability to stump the ball in transition. Guo picks up the foul. First foul for Guo. Remember this last night. Wonderful move to the hoop there from Al Marche. Nobody stopped him. Nobody could uh, stop him in his tracks. And Al Seuss sits down. And Jordan, with his free throw, will get right back into it. And it's a five point game now. UA got it by Al Marche. Number seven for China uh, for Jordan falls now. Sun Yue should take advantage. Great cover from Abdi, but you know what? China couldn't even capitalize on that. Five on four there. Sun Yue. Down low to Yi. Yi one on one with uh, Hadrab. Yi settles for jump shot. Misses. Cleaned up by red shirts. Marche, Baxter, Hussein, and a foul from Sun Yue on the dunk that was missed in the end. But uh, incredible there that how uh, China can take one player out of the game. Zhu Zhu. There's the beautiful pass from Baxter, well seen. And Sun Yue challenged, which is what you want to see for your plays. Well, he missed the free throw, so it's a good foul. Was an open layup. 
So he needs to make one of these. He needs to make this one. And he does indeed. Four point game. The wiry comes in. Hussein sits down. A job well done. Four fouls for Hussein. Dwyer, I think, has two fouls. I'll just check if he does, the youngster. Samuel Al Hamashe. Woke. A little bit of pick and roll to Sun Yue. Down low to Wong Julin. The foul against the big fella Al Dwyer. He just cannot help getting into trouble down there. Wong Julian will shoot two here. Been here before, the big fella from China, the youngster, two of two so far, eight points, three rebounds. Zhou Pong set to come into the game. Free throw went begging there. China need this win, there's no doubt about it. Last night's loss is still hanging around in their memories. Second one misses, he gets a rebound, he goes up, is blocked. Well, Hadrav, I think that's the second block he's had on Yi. Hadrav fires down the far end too, with speed. Baxter over the pick and roll. Advances a bit of Sun Yue here. Wong Julian, what a pass. Dwyeri, the foul from uh, Wu Ai Lun. Again, I like the way the Chinese are protecting their basket. Nothing easy under that hoop. It's a good philosophy. It's a starting point for anything. What a pass, Jimmy Baxter. And uh, Dwyeri went up hard. Made sure that uh, he got to the free throw. And now he's got to prove it on the line. 34 seconds left in the quarter. He sits down. Dwyer dribbles one in. Dwyer is a 50% free throw shooter in this tournament. Just tripped in his first point there. Oh, a little long and uh, wouldn't go in. Stays at three. So both teams hit a one of two on uh, either end. Sun Yue, I'm not sure he scored yet in this game. Scoreless. Zhou Pong, the jump shot, drains it. That's a short shooting there from Zhou Pong. He's Baxter. Sun Yue guarding him. Baxter penetrates hard, backboard, Jimmy Baxter with a sublime move there. Lead back to three, Sun Yue, the last shot hits the rim, it won't count. Baxter moves on to nine with that layup. 30 minutes are done, three quarters are over here in a five through eight semi-final. We have the big major semi-finals coming up, but this one's still got 10 minutes to run. China 55 and Jordan 52. Stats right there. China shooting 60%. A lot of that is to do with Wong Juju, who is uh, shooting eight for nine for the game for his uh, 21 points. And a drab 11 for Jordan. Back line here, China. The coaches, uh, Coach Janikas, there with his tie, his end of quarter talk. Ten minutes left of this when everything needs to be translated for his players, which can't be very easy. Especially when you want a selfie being done there with the uh, Chinese team in the background. Nice one there, young lady. 
<laughs> Smile on her face. It was good to see. Douglas <laughs> looks up at the scoreboard. He knows full well his troops are right there. High fives for everybody in the, on the team. Such an emotional coach. Gets so angry with the players on mistakes. Suffers no fools. It's the way it should be. Oh, he feels it. Abdeen here. One on one with Guo. Bounce pass down to Adrab. Can he beat? Back to down to Hal Drab. Drab got it by Zhu. What are they going to say on the floor? They're going to count it. Now they're going to wave it away. The foul uh, against Zhu Feng Yu. Sideline ball. Foul. Jordan Rice could be yes on the ball. Field Shot clock goes down to 14. So one more foul against China. So Jordan will want to get them into foul trouble early. Baxter flares off a screen. Mari pick and roll for Drab goes all the way. Another foul. This has got to be against 14, I think. No. Zhu uh, Fong Yu is collecting them like medals out there. Second foul in the space of 10 seconds for Zhu Fong Yu. Drab just uh, exposing Zhu Fong Yu's defense there. Back to back times. Second free throw is good. The second one is good as well. And so one pointer. A little one two two press down the floor here for Jordan. The referee not counting at all. Now he's going to count when he picks up the ball. Here's the double team. Sun Yue breaks it. Joe Pong breaks it. Guo is slightly fouled by Baxter. Xu Fong Yu goes up. Is fouled hard by Alduari. That's the fourth foul for Alduari. Sanders needs to go down that bench. Maybe he'll let this one run. Let the youngster just uh, play and foul out, perhaps. Well, there is uh, help on the on the bench for them. Hussein has four. Zagab has four. So there is a uh, why we will probably be allowed to run its course with his five fouls. Free throw is good for Zhu Feng Yu. The second one at least. Two point game. Leaves pressure, takes the pass, then goes double crossover on uh, Son Yue. And Baxter, very versatile player, seen a lot more today of passing, draws another foul. Son Yue saw it all as a technical foul, surely. Oh my goodness me. Son Yue showed all sorts of emotion there, right in front of the referee. The Jordanian bench are up in arms because. Uh, Wanted a bit of respect shown to his body, but uh, Sun Yue is upset because he thought he got all ball. Two shots with Baxter. This could tie it up here. Two free throws for Jimmy Baxter. Big breaths from Jimmy Baxter. Free throw finds a way to drop down. He is a four of five from the line tonight. Second player in double figures now for Jordan. Oh, Jimmy B coming up trumps. A bit of pressure for the floor for China. The one two two press, Sun Yue. Great. Uh, Escape from that press. Zhou Pong's in a bit of trouble if he's not careful. Up in the air. Reverse to Guo. Guo penetrates. Teardrop is not a great shot at all. No composure there from China. Once they've broken the press. Baxter one on one with Zhou Pong now. Baxter feeling it. Three. Jimmy B. No. My goodness me. That was almost down. Foul will go against Al Dwyri, I think. His day is done. The early bath beckons for Al Dwyri. Takes the long march off. He's fouled out. He's got 
some uh, good experience in this tournament. Al Dwyri played really well. So Gab comes in as his replacement, the experienced Mohammed, sorry, Ali Jamal Zagab. Anyway, tie game here, eight minutes and 40 seconds left. China in another battle. Adin's picked up a foul on the baseline.